We're excited that South Carolina State Parks are reopening. I mean, to be honest, parks just aren't the same without our visitors. But we need your help to keep everyone safe and ensure that our parks can remain open. Here's some information and a few tips that can make your next visit to a South Carolina State Park a great one from the mountains to the sea. Located throughout our parks will be signs to remind you of good social distancing practices. Remember to stay six feet apart from our staff and visitors. Avoid handshakes and other close physical contact with people. Limit your groups to three people or less and wash your hands for 20 seconds or more using soap and water. Feel free to bring your own soap or hand sanitizer with you when you visit our parks. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Wear a mask that covers your nose and your mouth. And please, if you do not feel well, postpone your visit and stay at home to protect our park family. South Carolina State Parks, we put into place several protective measures to limit contact between our staff and guests. At our admissions booths, we've installed physical barriers as well as provided our staff with PPE or personal protective equipment like gloves and face masks. Additionally, you can limit contact by purchasing daily admissions and park passports from our website, SouthCarolinaParks.com. Just show us your receipt when you arrive. We will accept cash and credit cards, but please plan ahead and know there are other methods of payment that will limit your contact with our staff. Also note, when the park reaches capacity, gates will be closed until some visitors exit. Hi guys, it's Ranger John from Charlestown Landing. While our parks will be open, our offices, our visitor centers, our interpretive centers, and retail outlets will remain closed for the time being. Uh, if you're camping or you've rented a cabin, please pay your balances online and then proceed directly to your campsite or cabin bypassing check-in. Uh, our staff will be working on site and contact numbers will be posted uh, in case you need assistance but you can't find a, a park ranger or a staff member. And lastly, please read all notices and uh, posted information and we'll do our best to communicate effectively with you on the parks. Our offices, visitor centers, and nature centers will all be closed, but you can still enjoy many of your favorite traditional park activities. We just will be operating a little differently, so please pack your patience. Our restrooms, they will be open, but we will have to close them down for periodic cleaning, so please find another one to use at that time. Our playgrounds and other areas where close physical contact is difficult to avoid may also be closed. Be aware of social distancing guidelines on fishing piers and boardwalks. We may have to restrict the number of visitors allowed at one time. A good rule of thumb if you're fishing is this fishing pole is about six feet and if you can touch your nearest neighbor you are too close and you will have to find another place to fish. Another thing that's going to change, we all love to cheer and high five people when we catch a fish or a crab. But in today's new world, we're all going to have to cheer from a distance. Yay! Hey guys, Ranger Terry at Charlestown Landing. I want you to get back out and enjoy the parks and some outdoor recreational opportunities. Uh, we also want you to remember to practice social distancing. Make sure that you're using uh, etiquette on the trails. Give people plenty of space to, to pass. And also remember about touching surfaces. Try not to as much as you can, but maybe even bring a little hand sanitizer with you uh, just to wash your hands and sanitize. While you're out, try to hike with the people that you live with. We want to minimize uh, contact with other folks. Unfortunately, all of our tours of our historic homes and lighthouse, along with all of our park programs are canceled for now but our beautiful grounds will be open to explore and enjoy. Be sure to come out and enjoy the fresh air, hike one of our trails, or bring a picnic and just enjoy the great outdoors. And in the meantime, be sure to check our Facebook and other social media pages where our programs traditionally held at all of our parks are gonna be available via live or video formats. Hello, my name is Ranger Dinks from Lake Harwood State Park. 
Gatherings of groups of people are not permitted during this time and reservations at group facilities such as community buildings, wedding venues, and picnic shelters have been canceled. These facilities will remain closed until we can safely open them to the public. We thank you for your understanding and we look forward to a time when groups can once again come together and enjoy our parks. We know that's a lot of information that we've thrown at you, but it's all important. And it's for your safety and your benefit. During this time, we encourage you to stay local and enjoy a South Carolina State Park located near you. We ask that you follow all social distancing guidelines and prepare for your trip before you leave home. Now, you don't have to memorize all this. All this information and more can be found on our website at SouthCarolinaParks.com. Hey, we're in this together, and it's all about staying safe, everyone. And remember, we miss you, we love you, and we look forward to seeing you in a South Carolina State Park real soon.